Welcome back to 23 ABC News. Food trucks have recently become a place to go for a quick bite to eat, and some local restaurant owners now have started questioning their policies and regulations. 23 ABC's Andrew Wirth has more from both sides tonight. Jerry Baranowski has owned a pizzeria in downtown Bakersfield for 25 years. He says he's concerned about the trend of food trucks setting up shop. We are concerned as far as uh, how many and when and where the food truck is going to pop up. Baranowski says he doesn't have a problem with these trucks, but questions their business and whether they are truly mobile. If you're going to say food truck, it's a mobile operation, right? Mobile, what does it mean mobile? You're moving from place to place. I think that the issue was escalated recently by the, by the one of the food trucks, which is uh, parking 24 hours in this safe spot. As a co-owner of Curbside Kitchen, Christian Gonzalez says that there are a lot of steps people never see to keep his business running. For this, you submit your uh, an application with the city and you let them know where you're going to be at. You draw a blueprint on the property and it's a process. And if they want information, they can call the city and find out how they do it. Gonzalez isn't sure why or who is complaining about the trucks, but says that those places are lucky to have such prime locations. If I had a restaurant, I could do so much more because my kitchen is very limited. So maybe they just have to step up their game a little bit. Baranowski also recognizes the impact that these trucks have on the community and what they do for the area. If you, if you would be saying if we want to kick them out, absolutely not. Absolutely not because they're good. They're giving attractiveness. They're giving the, what I call, I'm not sure if it's pro exotic flavor. As someone who works at one of these trucks daily, Marisol Santiago says they just want to make a dollar like everyone else. We, we don't just sit here for free. We pay rent here too, you know, for just being on this spot. And, you know, we just want to make everybody happy. We don't want anybody to get mad. We're doing business just like everybody else. As the director of Kern County Environmental Health, Donna Fenton says that these trucks must have approval to be on site daily and that things like hot and cold water, paper towels, and working restrooms must be available. Reporting from downtown Bakersfield, Andrew Wirth, 23 ABC.